three exercises for professional knockout front kicks. This is exercise number one. Be sure to like, Ooh. comment, subscribe, share. Before we start with the kicking, first thing you guys should do a stretch and before the stretch you guys should warm up the most important rule of self-defense is situational awareness guys i'm looking to my left side to the reflection to see the guy behind me as he moves and i'm unable to see him i look at the other reflection on the right side making sure i know where he's at always be aware of what's around you guys that can make the difference between life and death now stretch accordingly to your own limits obviously i'm an extreme case you guys don't have to go in a full space but make sure you're nicely stretched out and nicely warmed up and make sure you always look around you when you walk the streets now obviously the balance is tricky on this one even for me because i'm extremely sore when i make this video for y'all but you guys basically want to put your shin on the floor with your foot flat on the ground as if you were doing a roundhouse kick and you're going to push yourself up using only the strength of your front leg once you're up obviously you want to throw the kick as fast as possible I do it in front of this tube thing in front of me because this way I can really lift up my knee and my foot as high as possible so I can have the right proper technique and not be hanging my leg way too low below my knees. You guys want to lift that knee up. It was the exact same thing but more challenging. You guys are going to switch legs while you're down on the ground. Like any exercise for kicking, like I always tell you guys, you guys want to start slow, find your balance. Once you have your balance properly, then you can start speeding up the exercise. And you should speed up the exercise as soon as you're comfortable. You guys go as far down as possible and lift yourselves up. Kick as you are going up. Mentally, you should already be throwing the kick as soon as you push off the ground. Don't jump, don't come up and then kick. Kick as you're going up. You have to mentally do this. It will make a big difference in the way you guys are exercising your leg muscles. Also, make sure you breathe in on the way down, breathe out on the way up, and or yell. What? I'm going to give you guys a bonus number four or number five. Ah! Number four is a repetitive stretch. Now, I always stretch out before I train, and I also make sure that I stretch out afterwards. This is part of the reason I'm able to maintain my splits the way that I do. situational awareness so much guys is rubbing off on my cell phone yes my cell phone my iphone i've been recording with my iphone right here and as soon as a couple started to walk by the phone turned towards them looking at them and then the phone fell so hereby number five situational awareness don't forget guys to look around you my iphone learned the lesson the hard way you guys should learn it the easy way so the next video guys Catch you later.